Yo, it's Death of the Cloud Chaser TV, man. We back up in this thing again, you dig? Hey, man, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button for me, family. Share this on Facebook and Twitter. But let's get to it, man. You got um Ice-T, Ice-T, Kodak Black, um, a bunch of other rappers. You know, y'all probably heard by now about the Kodak Black situation that took place last night outside of the uh, Justin Bieber event. And basically, it was star-studded. You know, you had likes of allegedly um, Leonardo DiCaprio, Drake, Gonna little baby, the list goes on. Star studded event, but right outside the event, they saying that Kodak Black, you know, got approached by some people, and then a fight broke out. And as y'all can see from the video, looks like Kodak Black trying to defend himself, but whoever he's trying to defend himself from, they pulls out a gun, and they fire directly towards Kodak Black. Luckily, Kodak Black. Then die or lose his life last night, man. So prayers up to his family. He was just grazed with a bullet in the leg. You feel me? And uh, it's just a bad situation, man. Right now, Super Bowl weekend, the fans is out there. People that's really into football, you know, L.A., bringing home a Super Bowl. That shit going to be crazy inside of L.A. You know, but definitely a good look. But this particular situation definitely ain't no good look. But Ice-T, he comes in like this, man. He warns Kodak Black and he warns other rappers. And he said Ice-T shares a warning to young rappers visiting L.A. for the Super Bowl weekend. Super Bowl weekend, not a threat, just a warning. Young rappers coming to L.A. for the Super Bowl weekend. L.A. has over 50,000. He said 50,000 active gang members. Make sure you play it safe. It's the wild, wild west. Now, I don't know if rappers are going to take that advice. Or they going to, you know, move the way they've been moving. You know, a lot of them, from what we seen, where, you know, they rather they getting hit with Ricos, they getting shootouts, fights, at bowling alleys, all type of different shit is happening with these rappers. For these people to have all this money and the ability to hire people around them to make sure that they're not involved in certain, certain situations. It's, it's, it's just crazy, but at the end of the day, it's happening. It's happening inside our culture. So, it's some things that we need to think about. Some things that maybe the younger rappers that's on the come up that might be even watching this channel right now. You know what I'm saying? When you get on, man, move smart. You feel me? Because, like, rapping right now is, like, the most dangerous occupation. You feel me? You'll be better, shit, going to fucking law school or something for all them years or, you know, becoming a doctor. You know, and getting that money and being successful. So just keep that in mind, man. But um, I'm going to play some of the footage for y'all. As y'all can see with this footage, they hopping out.